Here we have a part with a fairly complex history tree. Sometimes it's difficult to manage and to know exactly which piece goes where. So what you can do now with PowerShell 2013 R2 is to right click at the top level and say group all. And what it will do is to hunt through and find any groups of features that all belong together, all created at the same time, and join those into a single group. We can come to any of these features and we can change its name, fill its underscore base, because I know that these are all of the fillets that form the rounded regions in this base. And I can access all of those fillets with a single click and turn them all off and get back to the sharp condition if I want to. So being able to group features together gives you a much simpler data management and it makes it easier for you to find out exactly which group of features form which function.